now for the thousands in attendance and the millions watching around the world. Uh, let's get ready to rumble! Boxing 2017 just continues to get better each and every day. It has been confirmed that Unified Junior Welterweight Champions Terrence Bud Crawford will take on fellow Unified Champion Julius Ndongo August 12th in Omaha, Nebraska. That is a huge fight. It is for all the belts. One of those two guys will be the undisputed Junior welterweight champion, IBF, WBO, WBA, WBC, ring and lineal champion. It doesn't get any much bigger than that. Both of these guys are talented. We all know that Bud, who is coming off of a spectacular victory and the utter destruction and domination of Felix Diaz, a 2008 um, Olympic gold medalist, he just outclassed dominated and toyed with Diaz, who is a terrific fighter in his own right. And Dungo had upset wins over Ricky Burns, where he took the WBO title. I mean, he was in attendance for the Diaz-Crawford fight, and Crawford called him out. And here we go. Not even a month later, we get the confirmation that these two will collide for all the marbles at 140. This is what boxing is all about. And we already know that even though the fight is taking place in Omaha, Nebraska, Terrence Crawford's backyard, where he's going to bring out 10,000 plus strong screaming fans. And Dungo is very awkward, very tough, and he's going to come to fight. He's going to bring it his A game. He's going to give it his all. Terrence Crawford, the same thing. These guys have been wanting this moment since they started boxing. And who would, the, who, who would ever thought that they would be in this position? To unify the division, to be known as the guy at 140, one face, one name, Crawford or Ndungo. And we all know that Crawford will be the favorite going into this fight, rightfully so. He's arguably a top five, top three pound for pound guy already. But he's looking to solidify his mark in boxing today by being recognized as the undisputed 140 pound champion before he makes the eventual move to 147 where more potential great things wait for him. I don't know. What where, where this fight would be aired on because earlier you know I made a video pertaining to Pacquiao Horn not being top televised on HBO and I mentioned um, Crawford and Dungo wouldn't be either as well as Salido Lomachenko too, um, but I expect the fight to be officially announced once Bob Arum and Top Rank are ready to reveal the big news that you know in terms of them signing. So, with this fight most likely being on network television, basic cable, you already know you don't have to pay much for it. It's going to be on free TV, no premium networks, no premium television, which is makes it even better. And this is going to market Terrence Crawford and Dungo, all the fighters from top rank, even more. Because a lot of people are not subscribed to Showtime and HBO. So, man, August 12th, man. Boxing is just getting better and better, man. I, I'm just excited, man, because we rarely seldomly get a uni a, a, a undisputed champion nowadays, a total unification bout for all the titles. The last undisputed champion in the men's boxing, I believe, was Zab Judah. Zab Judah, excuse me, at 140, way back, what, five, ten years ago. But if I'm wrong, correct me, but, man, I'm excited for this fight, man. This is going to be a great fight. 
for all the marbles, like I said. And it's going to be on free TV. Hey, when, the de when more details come out, I will give you an updated video. But mark your calendars. August 12th, Terrence Crawford versus Julius and Dungo for the WBA, WBO, WBC, IBF, IBO, ring, and lineal titles. Like this video. Give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to Colossal Boxing Talk. Drop those comments in the comment section below. Let me know what you think about this fight. Then head over to Twitter, follow us there at Colossal CBT. And smack that like button on the Colossal Boxing Talk Facebook page. Until next time, I'm out. Peace. <laughs>